Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Sorry, my dear class. I was there finishing the other class. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Welcome. How are you today? It is a great pleasure to have you here. Welcome. Okay. No me dejes entrar a la clase. <laughs> yeah, but we are here. We are here. Everybody, we are here. So welcome every single student here. Today is our last class. Welcome. Thank you very much for being here. Thank you for attending every single session. Es que me dejaba entrar, teacher, por, yes. por el link. I was. Solo it's... que se conecte así de, de Zoom normal. Yeah. Por el I... link. No, y siempre me he conectado así, por eso. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was just finishing uh, the previous session and maybe that wa that's why it was having, you were having difficulties to connect. But uh, it is so nice to have you here. Well, uh, welcome. Today we are going to practice people. I sent you some questions for you to review, right? I sent you some questions for you to practice. I hope that you have had the chance to actually practice and uh, we are going to talk about your first day of classes, right? The first day that uh, you were in the English class. How do you remember it? What did you do, right? And all these things. We are going to start with that. We are going to start remembering a little bit on your first day of classes at Inglés Corporativo. And then we are going to uh, work a little bit on uh, biographies, right? We are going to work a little bit on biographies and sharing personal details, right? So welcome to all of your Raul, Claudita, Joana, Arabella, Janet, Ruth Marielos, Liana, and Loren. Welcome here. So I am going to share my screen for us to go and talk about the first day of classes, right? The first day of school. What did you wear? Were you early, late, or on time? Where did you sit? Or what, what do you, what place of your house did you choose? How did you feel? Who was the first person you met? What did the teacher talk about? Who talked the most or the least? And how was your English then? And how is your English now? So we are going to talk a little bit about these differences. But before doing that, we are going to have a short reading. We are going to have a short session for reading. And let me just share it here. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for all the noise that I have here. So we are going to practice a little bit of reading. What is the importance of learning a second language? Okay. So can you all see my screen? Yes. Yes. Teacher. Yes. Okay. I am going to give you different words and you have to give me the sentence that has that word, okay? Yo le voy a decir una palabra y ustedes me van a decir cuál es la oración que tiene esa palabra en la lectura, okay? For example, if I tell you, memorizing. What is the many, sentence that has it? Many people many spend people time memorizing words. Out, out, out of books, right? That's the sentence, very good. If I tell you the word, uh, <laughs> Yourself. In. Yourself. Useful to yourself. Use. Okay, useful to yourself. But what is the sentence? ¿Cuál es la oración que la tiene? 
it will never break. Until you make the language useful mm -hmm. to yourself. So the complete sentence will be, however, until however, you make the language yeah. useful to mm -hmm. yourself, right? That is the sentence. What about the next one? Spending. Spending. Doing all, uh, all doing things as long as you are paid. as long as you okay, are also are spending time to speak the language. The language, the language. language. Good, the language. Now, is there any word that you don't know the meaning? ¿Hay alguna palabra que no sepan qué significa? It's like, teacher, what is the meaning of? Mm. Huh? If you know all of them, that's beautiful. New words, new vocabulary. Alguna palabra que no sepan que sea nueva para ustedes. Alone. Alone. And where is the sentence? Where is the sentence? ¿Dónde está? Ajá. Uh -huh. It sounds spoken to you. You can be some, uh, <clears throat> let me see. Ah, turn on the radio and sing along to songs. When you say sing along, it's like when you are singing at the same time, okay, al mismo tiempo. Sing along, it means at the same time. Cantar al mismo tiempo. Uh -huh. Any other one? Sooner. 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 No. Okay. Yeah. The sooner. The sooner you you can start effective communication with other English speakers, right? And it says the sooner. Soon. The word soon is como pronto, right? It's an adjective. Soon. Sooner. It. Lo más pronto. Más pronto que. Okay, in this case, you say, watch television shows that are spoken in English and try to follow along to understand what is going on in the story. The more you immerse yourself, here, the more you immerse yourself in the language, the sooner you can start effective communication. Okay, mientras más te sumerjas en los idiomas, Más pronto vas a empezar a tener comunicación efectiva. Okay? The more you immerse, the sooner you can have it. Right? It's like in Spanish, cuando decimos, entre más pronto empeces, más pronto vas a terminar. So, that's the comparison. It's a comparison. Another one? Any other one? Uh -huh. Okay, let's see. Where is the word? Where is the word native? Native. Where is the word native? Native. By native English speakers. By native English speakers. Okay, native English speakers. Native English speakers are the ones who speak the language naturally, right? For example, your native language, which one is? Which is your native language? Spanish. Spanish, right? Spanish is our native language because that is the one that we have spoken all our life, right? That is our native language. Let's see, where is the word where is the word story? 
story. Story, story. Story, story. He say I don't understand what what is going on in story. What is going on in the story? Very good. It's right here, right, right here at the bottom, right? What is going on in the story, right? Here I am. It is right here. Story. What is the difference between story and history? History is proven history. with facts, right? History is la historia, lo que está basado en datos, fechas, exactly like thing in paper, right? And a story is something like, ah, me acuerdo una vez que. So that's a story. History is like eh, El Salvador was founded in blah, 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 blah. El 15 de septiembre de 1821. That's history, right? So, Let's go along the paragraph, right? We are going to go along the paragraph and then I'm going to tell, uh, to talk a little bit about the meaning of it, okay? So here we have, learn English. Learning English can seem difficult at first. It takes a lot of dedication and discipline to learn a new language. But most importantly, it takes a lot of practice. Many people spend time memorizing words out of books some even write words and sentences on paper. However, until you make the language useful to yourself, it will never become a part of you. Doing all those other things are okay as long as you are also spending time speaking the language and trying to communicate with others. When you use the words and phrases you have learned to communicate with others, the language becomes more naturally more natural for you to learn. Also, you are able to hear how English speakers answer you, so you will know how the language sounds when it is spoken. Other good tips on learning a new language are to listen to as much of it as you can being spoken by a native speaker. Turn on the radio and sing along to sing to songs in English or watch television shows that are spoken in English and try to follow along and understand what is going on in the story. The more you immerse yourself in the language, the sooner you can start effective communication with other English speakers. What is the main idea of the paragraph? ¿Cuál es la idea central o la idea general del párrafo? Eh, tenemos que tener disciplina y the second language. Okay, we have to be disciplined about a second language. Good. Tell me, what are some tips that you can get from the reading? The speaking. Uh -huh. Mirar. Speaking. The reading. Reading. What else? When you I sing, practice. practice, listen to the radio, right? Good. Listen songs and speak it with uh, native. Okay, that's a good one. Speak with native English uh, speakers, right? To native sing English. native, native. Okay, to speak with native English speakers. To sing songs. To sing along, right? Si le gusta una canción en inglés, búsquese la letra y la va cantando al mismo tiempo. Right? What is the best to do this? Las mejores canciones, las más viejitas. Okay, las canciones más clásicas. Que tenían el, el inglés como más limpio, right? So, try to get some songs, right? And then you can sing properly, right? You are not going to be like every night. No, right? You have to get the lyrics for you to sing the song correctly. There's like the 
tiger, tiger. No, I need you to get the lyrics and sing songs correctly, right? So do it. It helps a lot. If you tell me, teacher, me gustan los BGs, me gusta, no sé, me gusta Whitney Houston, me gusta Celine Dion, me gusta cualquier uh, cantante, me gusta Adele, for example. Get the lyrics of the songs. Okay? And the Maroon 5. My, if you like Maroon 5, get the lyrics of the songs. Okay? No que aprendiéndose las canciones de Bad Bunny. No, 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 no. Eso no es del señor. No, no. cada vez que eso pasa se muere un diccionario. <laughs> don't kill the dictionaries okay <clears throat> so please no 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 <laughs> Anita se ríe. no get the lyrics of good english songs and follow guns and them roses. guns and roses they have very good songs they have very good songs right bon jovi right okay. if you like i don't know eminem follow it we can, follow we can it. watch series you can watch a series a good tip with the series, right? If you have if you have the series with English subtitles, play one minute, okay? Pongan un minuto de la serie. Póngale los subtítulos. Ponga un minuto de la serie. Ponga los subtítulos y trate de repetir el diálogo. That's a good a good practice. And then lo vuelve a poner, vuelve a poner el mismo minuto, vuelve a poner el mismo minuto hasta que le salga el diálogo igualito al de la serie. That's a good practice for you to uh, polish your language, right? Your pronunciation. That's a good tip, right? That's a very good tip that I can give you. Also with the music. Teacher, es que no lo puedo ir siguiendo. Play it. In YouTube, there is an option for you to lower the speed. Tiene una opción para bajar la velocidad del video. Use it. Use it, people. And say like, you are not going to be like, Never mind, I find someone. No, right? <laughs> but it's good. If you want to train your ear, you can do it as well. So please uh, practice. There are many audiobooks now that can be very beneficial for you to improve your English, right? There are sites for reading online that might be very, very useful. Okay. So, whatever type of practice you find, use it and share it. Si encuentran algo que les sirve a ustedes, compártanlo en el grupo. Miren, encontré estos videos. Miren, encontré este sitio. Miren, encontré estas, estas páginas. Why? Because your friends might need it as well. So, English is very necessary, but it is good if you practice, right? If you practice about this. Some facts about English. Some good facts about English. For this one, I need you to help me reading. I am going to share it again because Alejandro was having issues with this. And it says here, English is the language of international communication. Although English is not the most spoken language in the world, a pesar que el inglés, right? Although English is not the most spoken language in the world, it is the official language of how many countries? 53 countries. And it is spoken as a first language by around how many people? 400 million. 400 million people worldwide. Alrededor del mundo. But that's not all. It is also the most common second language in the world. According to the British Council, by 2020, about 2 billion people in the world will be studying English. So you are part of the 2 billion people who are studying English now. Two, you have 2 billion plus 1. 2 billion plus 20. <laughs> 20, yes. Plus 2 billion plus 20, all of us. Therefore, it is highly likely that if you meet someone from another country, you will both be able to speak English, right? If you meet someone from a different country and you don't speak the language, it is really probable that it's going to speak English. It gives you an open door to the world 
and helps you communicate with global citizens. So there is the importance of knowing a new language. You have another door to the world, right? You are learning something different. And also nowadays, many films, can you help me to continue reading? Everybody, vamos, ayúdenme todos. Many films. Many films. TV shows. Vamos, vamos, vamos. Books and music are published and produced in English. English. By understand, understand English, you want need to rely on translation and subtitles anymore. Continue, continue. This media, like you will you also will continue to improve your English listening and reading skills. Your English listening and reading skills. English is currently the language of the internet and estimate of five hundred sixty-two million. Five hundred sixty-five. Five hundred sixty-five million people use the internet every day. That's normal. Fifty-two percent of the world most visited websites are displayed in English. Therefore, English gives access to over half of the of the internet, which might be available over with other Otherwise, whether it is for fun or for work, if you understand English, you will be able to exchange information with more people online and use many more materials. Materials. <coughs> materials. Si, si les pongo el párrafo me van a decir, no, eso era avanzado, teacher, eso es muy avanzado para mí. I didn't mention anything and I say, I just started, right? <laughs> le di la confianza, leí el primero, leí el segundo y ahora ayúdame con este. And then you did it. And you didn't say that this has a lot of different vocabulary that you don't know. But maybe you say like, yeah, the teacher is reading, I will read as well. And you did it very well, right? For example, Difficulties in pronunciation, like published, produced, accessing, media, continuously, listening, right? Currently, currently. The numbers, 565 million, 52%. The world's most visited websites are displayed in English. Therefore, Learning this language gives access to over half the content of the internet, which might not be available otherwise. Right? Que si no supieran inglés no estaría disponible para ustedes. Because you don't know, right? Whether it is for fun, who oh no, right? Fun. Or for work, if you understand English, you will be able to exchange information with more people online and use many more materials. And the last part of information. Go ahead. English makes it easy to, easier to travel. Go ahead. English makes as, it easy uh, to travel. As highlighter. For size English is as, as a first language in 53 countries. countries and, as a and has a second language is over 118. 18 countries learning the language make it much easier to travel anywhere. In the 
I work I on movements, movements, animals, information, and and traveling to go a country where you don't speak the language to a country where you don't speak the language guarantee we understand a little song in English good job my dear class this is a little bit more challenging this was more difficult but you did a very good job you did a very good job you see it is a matter of being curious. Now you might be asking, what is the meaning of this? Aquí, más de alguna palabra de todo este párrafo se les quedó ahorita y dice, ¿qué significa esto? I ¿Cuál es? Ajá. Available. 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 Disponible. Available. Uh, what is the meaning of anywhere? Anywhere. Anywhere. Donde sea. Donde sea, right? Anywhere. Where do you want to eat? Anywhere. <laughs> Esa es la palabra favorita de todas yeah. las mujeres. Bicho ¿A dónde bicho. vamos? Anywhere. Ajá. No sem, no sem. Announcement. 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 Airport announcements. The passengers of the flight 345. Internacional. Airport announcements. Tin, tin, tin. Airport announcements. Ah, del... The airport ah. announcements. Ya those sé, are the es. ones. Those are the ones. Airport announcements are like, for example, like. Tin, tin. El parlante. Que te avisan, que A los pasajeros del vuelo. Ta, 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 ta. That is an announcement. Right? Um. Now, For yeah. example, at 9 p.m., all the students from Teacher Nati, please connect on Zoom because we have a class. <laughs> that is an announcement, right? That is an announcement, right? That's my dream. <laughs> I will do it someday. Yeah. That is an announcement. Train timetables. What is a timetable? When you go there to Terminal de Occidente, you have a big paper the there. Train. And the then, uh, yeah, aquí como no tenemos train, <laughs> we Tiempo. go to the, to the Terminal de Occidente, right? And then the timetables, it's just like... <laughs> terminal de tren. Ajá, uh -huh. el, el bus a Sant, uh, Santa Ana, tal hora. Uh, el bus a Huachapán, tal hora. Cierta hora, cierta hora. Right, there is a timetable. So, bus a Sonsonate, 2 p.m. Bus a Santa Ana, 2.30. Bus a Metapan, 3.30. So there is a timetable. Because it says the time of what is going to happen. This is a timetable, right? But they are big and they are there like enormous timetables, right? Emergency information, street signs, las, las señales de tránsito, street signs are often available in English. Imagine if you don't know English and the only manual for the extinguisher is in English. Imagínese que el extinguidor tiene la, la información en inglés. Se quema todo. It would be like, tráeme el diccionario. <laughs> All right. You need to know the language. Because Con la cámara. You know. el <laughs> right, no. So, eh, as highlighted before, como se mencionó antes, Como lo resaltábamos antes, as highlighted before, highlighted means recalcar. As highlighted before, since English is spoken as a first language in 53 countries and as a second language over 118 countries, learning the language makes it much easier to travel anywhere. You can go to China and people can speak English. You can go to Australia and people can speak English. You can go to Canada and they speak English. You can go to the United States and they speak English, right? Anywhere in the world. Indeed, en efecto, airport annou announcements, train timetables, emergency information, and street signs are often in English. 
including in countries where the native language uses a different type of alphabet. Aún cuando estén las letras ahí en tailandés, va a estar en inglés también. Diferente. <clears throat> yes. Siempre va a estar en el, en el idioma natal y en inglés. Um, it goes mm -hmm. without saying that when traveling to a country where you don't speak the language, you are practically guaranteed, guaranteed, garantizado, guaranteed to find someone who understands at least some English. So, even if they don't speak uh, the language of you, I mean your language, they are going to speak English. So, that is something, that is something uh, very, very well proof. And on this one, you are going to read with me. English can make you smarter. Go ahead. English can make you smarter. English can make, English you, can make you smarter. Smarter. What is the meaning of smarter? Smarter. Smart. What is the meaning of smart? Muy intelligent. Uh -huh. Muy intelligent. Smarter. Más intelligent. It can make you smarter. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Learning. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Ahora con confianza, díganmelo con confianza, sin miedo. Learning, learning a foreign language. Listen, 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 listen. Escuchen primero, escúchenlo bien, escuchen la pronunciación y ahí traten de imitarlo lo más posible. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Your cognitive and analytical abilities. Your cognitive and analytical abilities. Analytical. Analytical abilities. Analytical, no. Analytical. 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 There you go. ¿Y cómo es esa? Enhances. 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 Aumenta. Enhances. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Vamos todos. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Bueno, nosotros dos pues. Okay. Everybody, practice with me. Háganlo como que me lo estuvieran dando para un comercial de TV. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Learning a foreign language enhances your cognitive and analytical abilities. Very good job. You did it great. The next one. Learning a new language can be difficult and it involves a lot of mental exercises. Okay, <clears throat> véndamelo como open English. Learning a new language can be difficult and it involves a lot of mental exercises. Learning, Learning a new language can be difficult and a lot of mental exercises. Okay. No lo duden, no lo duden, sin miedo. Learning a new language can be difficult and it involves a lot of mental exercises. Learning a new language can be difficult and involves a lot of mental exercises. Good. Very good job, very good job. The next one, the next one, people, the next one. Research, research, escuchen esta, research from a 2012 Swiss study, research from a 2012 Swiss study 
shows that learning a new language changes the brain structures, impacting the parts of the brain responsible for the memory, conscious thought, and it can make you more creative. Okay, we're mm -hmm. from 2012 mission that is learning a new language and the brain is a part of the brain. The brain is impacted the parts for memory. The brain is responsible for memory. I make more more creative. Re, okay. <clears throat> create, create. Research. 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 Research from a 2012 from Swiss study. 2012. Research from a 2012 Swiss study. 2024, no. 2012. 2012. 2012. Shows so, that learning so, a new language so, so the so learning, the learning a, new a new language changes the, changes the brain structures. Changes the brain structures. the brain structures. Impacting the part. Impacting. Impacting the part of the brain responsible for memory. Responsible responsible for memory. memory. Conscious thought and, and, and it can make it can more, make more, more create. Create. <laughs> Conscious. Conscious. Creative. 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 Responsible. 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 Conscious thought. Conscious talk. More creative. More, More creative. 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 Okay, now yeah. you have to feel confident that you are reading. Imagínense que se lo están leyendo ahí a alguien sumamente importante. Y le están contando qué importante es. Y dice, research, research from a 2012 from... Swiss study shows that learning a new language changes the brain structures impacting the parts of the brain responsible for memory, conscious thought, and it can make you more creative. Go ahead. Research from a 20... Everybody, everybody, no, 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 no. Todos, everybody, go, go ahead, go ahead. Everybody, open your microphones and practice. Action. Research from a 2012 Research study that shows that learning a new language Ahora solo Juan Carlos, después solo Eneida y después solo Raúl. Go ahead. Vamos Juan Carlos. It's your turn. Juan Carlos, where are you? Cinco, cuatro, tres, dos, uno. Perdimos a Juan Carlos. Joana, go ahead. Research from a 2012 Swiss study shows Swiss, Swiss study. Swiss study shows. Well, vamos a empezar. Research from a 2012 Swiss study. Research from a 2012 Swiss study shows the shows, shows, shows shows. Research from a 2012. Research from a 2012 Swiss Swiss study. Swiss, Swiss. Research from a 2012 Swiss Swiss study shows, 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 shows that running a new language change, changes, changes 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 the brain structures the, the biggest structures <laughs> research from a 2012 Swiss, Swiss study, study. Shows 
those that are learning a new language changes changes the brain the brain structure, the brain structure. <laughs> in pay the impacting Impacting. impacting the part of the brain response responsible responsible for memory conscious um, conscious thought conscious thought and can make you more creative 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 okay like a <laughs> es que lo que pasa es que ahí, ahí, ahí es donde casi la mayoría, teacher, Ajá. ahí es donde se, se, cuando uno quisiera agarrarlo todo de un solo, ahí es donde cuesta más. Por que eso. Que hablarlo así de corrido. Practice. It's a matter of practice. Aquí es de practicar todo el tiempo. Eneida, go ahead. Ok. Research from our uh, um... 2012. 2012, Swiss studies shot they learned a new language. Changes? Uh, in, in part, in part, in part, in part in Changes the brain structures. Okay. So, so the learning a new language. Change the brain, the brain structure impacted the parts on the brain responsible for memory. Um, conscious, conscious thought. Conscious thought. And it can make. It can make you. Creative. More creative. Creative. Just more, more creative. 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 <laughs> Raúl Antonio, go ahead. Research from 2012. Three study show that the learning and the new language change the brain structure impacting the space of the brain responsible for memory conscious time. And you can make you more creative. 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 People, everybody. A ver, todos abran su micrófono, por favor, y digan conmigo. Creative. 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 Conscious. No es Spanish, no es Spanish. The next one, conscious thought. Conscious thought. Conscious thought. Structures. Structures. Brain structures. Brain structures. Changes the brain structures. Changes the brain structures. Impacting the parts of the brain. Impacting the parts, parts of the brain. brain. Responsible for memory. Responsible for memory. Conscious thought. Conscious, Conscious thought. And it can make you more creative. And it can make you more creative. In the long wow. term. In, in the, the long in term, the long long term, term. In the long term, bilingualism, bilingualism can keep the brain strong and healthy. Can keep the brain strong and healthy. 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 There you go. Healthy. 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 Into old age. Into old age. And supports concentration. And supports concentration. And memory skills. And memory skills. In the long term. 
In the long term. In the long term. In the long term. 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 No, aquí, ter. ¿Cómo le dice de guarda el café en la mañana? Ter. Term. 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 Ok, no termo. En the long term, no. En the long term. En the long term. En the long term. Bilingualism. 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 Okay. Bilingualism. Tenemos by. By significa dos, right? Lingua, language. Lingua. And lism is the ending, right? Lism. Bilingualism. Bilingualism. can keep the brain strong and healthy. Uy, 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 se me muere, se me muere. ¿Qué pasa? Water, 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 water. water. Así ya, ya, ya estaba afinando la garganta. Vale. Okay. In the long term, <coughs> bilingualism can keep the brain strong and healthy. Okay. Bilingualism, bilingualism can keep the brain strong and healthy. In the brain strong and healthy. Into old age and support old age and memory skills and supports concentration and memory skills. Concentration and memory skills. 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 Juan Carlos, hoy sí ya te vi. Go ahead. In the long term. <laughs> In the long term, bilingualism. 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 Can keep, can, can keep the brain strong and healthy into all age and support concentrations. And memory skills. Okay, ahora dígamelo completo. In the long term, bilingualism can keep the brain strong and healthy into old age and support concentration and memory skills. Go ahead. In the long term, bilingualism can keep the brain strong and healthy into old age and support concentration and memory skills. A clap for Juan Carlos. Very good job. Very good job. Todos, todos, todos son, son de gratis. El aplauso no va cobrado. Go ahead, please. Thank you very much. Good, good job. Good job, Juan Carlos. You see the difference. ¿Ven la diferencia de que lo leamos así como chopeado, con machetito, o cuando lo leemos de corrido? Right? You say, in the long term. Eh, eh, eh. Como que nos lo vamos pagando por cuotas, right? No, it has to be all, all over, right? On, a, on an individual level, here you have, on an individual level, on an individual level. On an individual on level. An individual level. Okay, Labels. on an, on an, on an. Okay. On an individual level. Very good. On an individual level. ¿Y por qué me detengo aquí? Vamos a ver. Level, a ver. Atención, atención. ¿Por qué me detengo en esos espacios? On an individual I'm level, because there is a comma, right? I'm it mm. improves personality and increases sense of self-worth. Y hasta ahí detengo la frase, porque hasta aquí está el punto, right? Here is the period, right? Here you have the period. On an individual level, it improves personality and increases sense of self-worth. What is the meaning of self-worth? Amor propio, valor propio. Valor On an individual propio. level, it improves personality and increases sense of self-worth. On an individual On level, level, it improves personality person. and increases and sense, of sense of self-worth. Self increases sense of self-worth. Improves personality. On an individual Improve level, it, personality. it improves personality, personality and increases sense of self-worth. Self ok, todos, vamos al mismo tiempo y digámoslo de corrido. On an individual on level, an it improves level. personality an level, and increases uh, sense of self-worth. On an individual level, it improves personality and increases sense of self-worth. Ok. Important. Esto es algo muy importante. No se coman las letras. 
He says it improves, improves, improves. personality and increases, right? Increases. Sense of self worth. On an individual level, it improves personality and increases sense of self worth. Go ahead. On an individual level, Personality. Personality. Increases. 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 Sense of self-worth. Janet, vamos. Janet, you can do it. Vamos, Janet, tú puedes. On an individual level, in close personality, in increased sense of self-worth. Bah, lo vamos a decir, pero no nos comamos las letras. On an individual level, it improves personality and increases sense of self-worth. Vamos otra vez. On an individual level. On, on an individual level, it, it improves, improves, improves personal, personality, personality and increases sense of self-worth. Increases, increases, Increases sense of self-worth. Self? Self-worth. Self very good. Good job, Janet. You did a very good job. Great effort. Alejandro Jovel, go ahead. Okay, teacher. On an individual level, it improves personality and creates sense of self-worth. Increases. Increases. Okay, on an individual level. On an individual level, it improves personality and increases sense of self-worth. Very good job, right? It increases sense of self-worth. Everybody, the last sentence. In simple words, learning a foreign language makes the brain stronger and more versatile. In simple, in words, simple words, learning a foreign in language words, makes the brain stronger, make the brain more stronger versatile. and more versatile. 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 In simple words, learning a foreign country, a foreign country. <laughs> Again, <laughs> in simple words, learning a foreign language makes the brain stronger and more versatile. In simple words, learning a foreign language make a brain stronger and more versatile. 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 Very good, very good job, my dear students. The best thing that you can do, okay? Ya ven, pueden agarrar un párrafo, cualquiera. Un párrafo en inglés, cualquiera. And you can do the same practice that I did with you, okay? You can do the same practice that I did with you. And how many things you learn? Pronunciation, vocabulary, learning, uh, structures, many things. Grammar from one little paragraph. It can be really, really helpful, okay? On YouTube, they, they, you have a lot of readings, right? Ahí en YouTube te sale el párrafo y te lo va leyendo. Y ahí lo puedes ir pausando, repitiendo, pausando, repitiendo. So, it is a matter of practice. Because English can make you feel a lot smarter. And English can make you feel a lot better when you do it. Okay? When you practice. So, my dear students, important things about English. Right? Practice is going to make perfection. Remember, remember, my dear class. Set a goal, right? Pónganse una meta. ¿Para qué lo quieren? Set a goal in English. Find a routine, right? Todos los días de 7 a 8 en lo que voy en el bus, en lo que voy en la calle, voy a ir practicando esto y esto. Find a routine. Para el almuerzo, en vez de ver TikTok, en vez de ver WhatsApp, en vez de ver Facebook, vean videos. Repitan ahí, practiquen. So, find a routine. Y de... De las 10 a las 11 me quedo viendo videos en TikTok. Me voy a poner a ver videos en inglés. Ok. Find a routine. Make mistakes. Ok. Make mistakes. Equivóquense. It's ok. But practice a lot. 
That's very important. Practice a lot. Learn phrases, not only words. Practiquen y aprendense frases, no solo palabras. Learn phrases. Practice vocabulary. And it is, it is possible. Record yourself, okay? Grábense ustedes mismos hablando. Record yourself. Read new words and phrases. Read about things that you like, right? If you like football, if you like soccer, if you like music, read about that, okay? If you like that, read about, about that. Message people in English, okay? Message people in English. If you uh, have friends, you have here 20 friends that you can message in English, right? Yes. Practice your English and uh, message them in English. Watch movies in English with English subtitles. Si tienen, si tienen una película que ya la vieron mil veces y que ya se la pueden, play it in English and put the subtitles in English. Póngale los subtítulos en inglés, póngale el audio en inglés. And listen to the movie Mr. in If you know it, that's perfect, right? You can watch it. Use a dictionary. It is very useful to use a dictionary because you can learn new words, right? No sé qué significa, voy y la busco. But use good dictionaries, right? No pajarito en inglés.com, right? No, no, no. Use good dictionaries. Here, for example, in the chat, I am going to send you one that it's called wordreference.com. And in that one, you can find good definitions. Listen to the pronunciation of the words. Si no saben cómo se pronuncia, no le inventen la pronunciación. In Google, how do you pronounce this? How do you pronounce? Y escriben la palabra. There you are going to have videos, you are going to have explanations, you are going to have the audios on how to do the things. But the most important people, the most important thing is to set a goal of the language. ¿Para qué lo quiero? ¿Para qué lo quiero en mi vida? ¿Para qué lo necesito? Okay? If you set a goal and you are following it, do it. Okay? Do that that you are working for. Si usted dice, yo lo quiero porque quiero eh, un mejor trabajo, do it. Yo lo quiero porque le ayudo a mis hijos, practice. Okay? Yo lo quiero porque quiero aprenderlo bien, do it like that. But I need you to actually practice, right? No es así de que, ay, teacher, no avanzo en el inglés, fíjese. Pero no estamos haciendo nada para aprender. So please, my recommendation in this final class is practice, practice, and more practice. I am going to call the attendance people. And later on, I am going to give you the final tips. Alejandro Jovel. Present teacher. Ana Elizabeth. Present. Arabella. Arabelita. Carlos Alberto. Present teacher. Carmen Barrera. Present teacher. Thank you. Carmencita. Claudia Iris. Yes. <laughs> She's there. Yeah, yeah, teacher. Denis Eliseo. Present teacher. Eli. Eli Antonio. Yeah. I I uh, no, he was driving, right? And they he was coming. From, yeah, Eneida Veronica. Present teacher. Uh, Janet Rosibel. Present teacher. Thank you, Jennifer Alejandra. Joanna Damaris. Present. Juan Carlos Cubillas. Present. Thank you. Okay. Jennifer Alexandra, no estamos. Veamos. Jennifer, Jennifer. No. Okay. <laughs> Liana. Present teacher. Lorena Saray. Marvin Neftali. Present teacher in the, on the chat. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, I saw it. Eh, let me see. Yeah, Lorenita. Odilia. Present teacher. Thank you. And Marvin. Marvin, where are you? Ah, Marvin Present is here. Teacher. Thank you very much. Raul Antonio. Present teacher. Ruth Marielos. Here teacher. Sandra Georgina. 
And Silvia Lisset. Thank you. Uy, esa moto salvaje. So, mm, con todo. <laughs> my dear class, my best recommendation for you is not to stop what you started. Si ya lo iniciaron, si ya van en este proceso, no se detenga. Okay? If you started studying, even when it is difficult, even when the time is difficult, when everything seems so hard, do it. Continue learning. Okay? Don't, I mean, don't listen to people. It's like, ay, que noche estudiamos. Ay, no, que cansado. Ay, no. Don't listen to that. Because it's your own benefit. Okay? It's your own benefit. I know sometimes it's difficult. Yo sé que a veces ya están así como, me caigo, teacher, me pierde. No, <laughs> but practice. Continue your best job, okay? I want to see you graduating, definitely. And if you started, do it, okay? ¿Ya se inscribieron todos para el otro nivel? Yes? Yes. Yo sí. Okay. If you did it, continue, please. Continue working because it is going to bring you a lot of benefits, okay? Denny, Eliseo, falto, falto yo, dice, de inscribirte. <coughs> o oh, de qué me faltaste, Denny? O de no asistencia. Me, no me he inscrito oh, todavía, teacher. Ah, 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 ok, ok, ok. So, do it, Denis, do it. Hágalo hoy en la noche, mándelo. O mañana en la mañanita, pero mándelo, ok? So, okay. please, my dear students, you cannot imagine how big has been the pleasure of being your teacher. I really love every single class. Disfruté cada una de las clases. It was so fantastic that I will remember you a lot. If you need me and I can help you with anything, send me a message and I will be more than glad to help you, okay? So please continue studying, continue working. Si se traban alguna vez en la plataforma, teacher, ayúdeme. I will be more than glad to help you, okay? For any level that you are, it will be okay. Thank you very much, my dear class. Have a wonderful Christmas, a fantastic new year. Continue studying. Yes. And I really keep you in my heart. And it Thank has you, been teacher. everything. Thank you very much. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Thank you very much. I will keep you with me forever. Thank you very much. Have a fantastic night. And I am here. Whatever thing you need. Save my number, send me a message, okay? Have yeah. a wonderful night, and I am going to see Bye, you teacher. soon. Good night. In Bye, next. I see you, teacher. Have a wonderful night, Good people. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 See you. Have a wonderful night. Bye-bye.